Hello, hello everybody. This is Moni with Flowers by the Bunch. I hope you are having a wonderful afternoon. So today we are going to do a casket piece for a funeral and we were asked to do it in all white roses. So I am just going to green out this casket saddle. I have placed um, two pieces of fresh flower foam onto this casket saddle. The saddle is um, the saddle is just it's just a plastic um, casket saddle. It sits right on top of the casket, and I took um, some waterproof tape and I taped the foam into place. And now what I'm going to do is I am just going to green it out. The greenery that I'm using today is called Jade. Um, it is a type of palm branch um, we get here. And this is what we always use as our base for a funeral piece. Um, it's just a pretty good size greenery. And so it works really well um, for a casket piece. I'm taking my greenery and I'm cutting it into two pieces. Um, and then I am using the bottom piece just as a little fill-in. Now, when you go to use um, fresh floral foam, you want to use, you want to soak it in water first before you add it to your um, to your saddle. So what I'm doing is I am just filling my foam with greenery, and this just gives us a really good, easy base to work with. It usually takes about a bundle and a half to um, to fill in my base of greenery, and then I'll come back in with some pretty greenery. This always takes just a little bit of time. I've always been one that really likes to green mine out first. Um, not all designers are the same, and not everybody um, greens out their piece first. For me, I just find greening it out is my easiest, easiest way. So there's my greenery. Next, what I'm going to do is I am going to grab some spray. Just a second. Okay, so this is this is this plant shine. And what this does is it just kind of shines up those leaves. Next I'm gonna come in. We get these um, these bundles of um, greenery from our um, our grower. And just putting mixed greens through my knife on the floor. 
So I'm gonna just take these pretty greens and just tuck us a few um, of these pretty greens into this piece. So I put a little bit of this form in. That's um, lily grass because it's just pretty. This is sword fern. I took a little bit of that here and there. Leather leaf. And this is a pretty type of palm that kind of gives us just a, a fun, creative little bit of different texture. Um, I just like it. It's just pretty. And then I have a second bundle. I'm going to use two bundles of those, um, of those greens in this. good in that bundle so I'm just throwing that right away. A little bit of this leather. I just like the different textures of the greenery. I know it seems like good golly Miss Molly you're gonna add greenery and add greenery. When are you ever gonna stop? And I'm just about done. <laughs> so I know that that seems like it's taken forever. It's just part of it. But the greenery to me I mean, is as important as the flowers. So this is going to be a very simple um, casket piece. And what I mean by that is it's going to be all the same type of flower. They chose all white flowers. So the flowers um, they chose were just white roses. So these are called Mondial Roses. I love this variety. It's just a large rose. It's a pretty rose. Um, a very hardy rose. Um, it's just pretty, just easy to work with. Um, at Valentine's Day, this is the only variety white rose I will carry. And it's just strictly because it's a good rose. And I never have any issues with it whatsoever. And you can see how big, that's a huge rose. I mean, they're really big heads. They're just so pretty. And so we have already wired all of these roses before I got started, which helps take a little time, um, helps speed up the time, I guess. It doesn't take me as long to arrange. There will be 75 white roses in this arrangement. So roses, when you order them from your wholesaler or from your provider, all right. So you are just going to going to keep putting flowers in it until it's full. Um, this arrangement is going to have 75 white roses. Um, and these roses are called Mondial roses. Mondials come in a white and in a pink. And the pink is kind of a baby girl, a real pale blushy colored pink. But these are the, um, I, for Valentine's Day, I always order white Mondials and I always order pink Mondials. And it's just strictly because this is the, perhaps the best variety rose I have ever bought for the holiday. Honestly, it's the best variety rose for any, anything. It's just a big, showy, pretty white rose.
And so I'm just taking those. You'll remove any petals that are bumped or bruised. So I'm just taking, and I'm just popping off any petals that are, that are bumped or bruised. And tucking those right into this arrangement. Now, not all florists wire their roses. Here at Flowers by the Bunch, we wire, we wire 98% of all of our roses. And it's just strictly because I feel like they're going to last longer for my customers. And I would rather you have a good experience with a rose than for that rose to go down. So, I like I like to have all of our roses wired. And especially this is a funeral service. So um, they will have a visitation overnight and then they will have the service tomorrow. And so because the flowers will not be in the cooler and they're just in the oasis, um, we always like to have them wired. Just guarantees their freshness. Look how big these roses are. They're so big and so pretty. Just such a really pretty rose. Looking for something? Green glove. Green glove here. You're welcome. So that one was broken, so it's okay. I just cut it and we're gonna tuck it deep down into this arrangement. Keep dropping them on the floor. Now with a casket piece, you can put ribbon in it if you would like. Ribbon is not necessary, but if you like ribbon, you can absolutely put it in there. And it really, for me, depends on the arrangement, depends on the customer, depends on their taste and what they have in mind. Um, ribbon is beautiful, so it's completely preference.
Look how big that flower is. That is a huge white rose. Much further down. Just about done. All right, I'm going to come around to the front and just make sure. Put it on the floor. And there we have it. There is an all white casket piece. Guys, thank you so much for being here with us today. I, um, I'm so excited that you're here with us and that we have so many um, new followers. If you like videos like this, please be sure to subscribe down below and hit that bell so that you'll get notifications. Guys, y'all have a wonderful day and we'll see you all real soon. Thank you.